This is the largest of the city's 14 plants. It's a 310 million gallon a day facility for wastewater. Our daily average, based on the population of the 25 square miles that make up Newtown Creek, is about 245 to 250 million gallons a day of wastewater. We actually first got involved through the uh, New York City Art Commission, who recommended us to uh, the, the joint venture of three engineering firms that were hired to do this project. So we're the kind of executive design architect for, for the whole project. Because it is a 54-acre sewage plant, and you know who wants to live next to a 54-acre sewage plant? We've done everything possible to make it as nice as, as possible. We designed, uh, in the, early in the project, uh, a visitor center which is uh, near the main entrance, the little orange twisted cube that's pulled away from the rest of the geometry of the, of the whole plant. In each aeration tank, there are 10,000 stone diffusers. They look like a series of mushrooms on the floor. They're about uh, uh, 14 inches off the ground. They're about eight inches in diameter, and there are 10,000 of them per tank. I have 24 tanks. And that makes a very fine bubble. As you can see behind me, this is the electrical grid of the plant. Less than half of my day's production is needed for me. The rest of it's going to go back and be sold to the utility. The first floor, four on the second floor that bring in the, the raw power and transform it down. All right, so let's go up on the eggs. This project being worth over a billion dollars, they actually decided they could have more than one artist. They picked Vito Akanchi to do a piece in and around the visitor center and they picked George Trakas to do a whole waterfront piece that runs around the whole perimeter of the site. It's actually a kind of nature walk working along the edge of Newtown Creek itself. They didn't pick uh, L'Observatoire, the, the great lighting designers, uh, Hervé Desco, but in fact the Department of Environmental Protection thought that L'Observatoire was so good that they hired them anyway, uh, and they did all of the fabulous blue lights that you see at night. big enough to fill one of these eggs, so I have to be very careful. Take a look inside. Okay, you want to look yourself? The other thing I want you to do is feel this pipe. It's 98 degrees. This is your body temperature. The reason it's 98 degrees is because the methane gas is the same gas that's inside of your bodies, and it fermented the same way your belly takes the energy from the food that you eat. It's, a, it's like a big stomach. When I flush the toilet, this is where it goes, right here. 